Good morning. If you're just joining us, my name is George. We had a house fire, but everything is fine. But because of that, we're going to be doing a few projects around here. One of which is finding a better way to deal with the DeWalt tough system. Thank God for these boxes. They've saved all of my tools from water that was in the house. However, now that we're putting them out in the shop, stacking them up like this isn't the greatest deal only because I can't get to the tools on the bottom without lifting all the boxes up that are on top of it and putting them elsewhere. So for right now, we're gonna make a shelf system for it. I can buy one, DeWalt has one for like a hundred bucks, but trying to save some money, I have a little bit of plywood around here, a little bit of scrap that I can use to make something. So I'm gonna do that. So we're gonna build something here real quick and hopefully you enjoy. This is going to be a pretty simple build using half inch plywood and a couple of two by fours. So if you stick around to the end, I will show you the dimensions you're going to need in order to build it. Once you cut all your strips to an inch and three quarters, you're going to want to bring them over to your chop saw and cut them all down to length. I chamfered the edges on one side of all these strips in order to let the boxes slide onto them a little bit easier. Here I used a small roundover bit to smooth out all the edges on these strips. And it's not really the right way to use a router, but it works just fine and it's really quick and easy to do with this DeWalt. So you need to figure out the distance between boxes vertically that you're going to want based on the boxes that you have, being that this is all customizable on what you currently own. There we go. This is so much more useful just because I can grab this box, yank it out, shove it right back in. They're not on too much of an angle, but they're holding just fine. If I really want to make them lock in, what I would do is just throw a little piece of plywood right here, a little nub, and just angle it so that as it's riding back into here, the angle will let it ride up and then it would snap into place as soon as it got beyond that point. And I'll just do it on one side. And then when you want to take it off, you just lift the one side handle and pull from here and you're good to go. This is great because I was tired of grabbing four boxes off of the bottom box just to get to something I needed. 
Granted, like I said, the tough system is amazing. 2.0 is awesome with these latches right here. The 1.0, I'm not that crazy about just trying to rip those off of there when you need the certain boxes, but these are great. And like I said, they saved my tools from fire. And speaking of fire, hug your loved ones tonight. And if you can, check your smoke detectors. Always check them because they definitely do save lives. So there you go.